Casey from Painted White Lines here with an instructional video on how to make our cupcake toppers and wrappers. The cupcake wrappers will come with a two and a half inch circle for the back and a two inch circle for the front. You can cut these out with straight scissors for smooth lines or with uh, cloud scissors for scalloped edges or uh, you can use a Fisker's two and a half inch hole punch with, uh, they come in loads of designs. I've got one here that is two and a half inch uh, cloud to make the cloud look, which is like a large scallop. Um, I've also got scissors that can be used to cut the top of the cupcake wrapper so that it too can have scallops. And I've got uh, tape for the cupcake wrappers, glue, and toothpicks for the cupcake toppers. So the first thing I'm going to do is, I'm just gonna do one. So I'm, I'm gonna pick this cute little wire hair cat. And I am going to cut her out. Again, you can use scissors to cut this out really easily. Or if you're a super big perfectionist and you happen to have a two inch Fiskars, you can cut this a little bit closer, flip this over, and you can see what you're cutting on the back. You can stick that in and just like that, get a very perfect circle. So I love this little Fiskars thing. And the same thing for the two and a half inch back. You can cut it out with scissors for a smooth line. I'm gonna get a little closer to it so that the Fiskars hole punch do its magic. This is a two and a half inch. And just like that, you've got a very perfect two and a half inch circle. And the only thing you have to do is take your glue stick, put glue on the back. I like to also glue the top of the stick. I'm gonna set this on here like this. I'm gonna flip this around and get this just the way I want it. This is not the cat I meant to, <laughs> to grab, but it works. You got a little bit of time to move it around the way you want it. And then just rub it. Good to get it secured. And these glue sticks dry extremely quickly. And then for the wrapper, you can use these scalloped scissors. Here, I'm going to cut it all out first with my smooth scissors for the base. And once you got that, if you want the scalloped edges, you can take your cloud scissors and just cut them just like this. And then you just wrap it around. I really should have a cupcake here. And then you've got your nice little cupcake wrapper and your cupcake topper. So your cupcake goes in, this goes on top. And that's it, it's extremely easy. You can also wrap a little ribbon around and tie it. Uh, they look really cute like that too.